Ta -da. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Hi guys. We have a special video for you guys today. Kyle and I have been building muscle for a long time, as you guys know, uh, for about six months now. And we have decided that we still have a little bit of body fat that we would like to get rid of to show all of our hard work. It is showing, but we'd like it to show a bit more. So we are going to do a mini cut. Um, and we're going to basically do our own diet. You won't see this anywhere because this is something that we've talked about and created um, according to what is going to work for our body. So um, yeah, we will post how we did on Instagram. Um, the reason why this diet is going to be kind of like our own version of a low carb diet and we have said that we don't think that they work and we do we do believe that that low carb diets don't work for long periods of time so we're going to do our own version for a very short period of time to try to preserve our muscle because when you do low carb you will lose muscle so this is our version to try to keep muscle and lose body fat at the same time. Yeah, and you guys have seen mm -hmm. us carb cycle. We've posted full days of eating of our carb cycle, our yes. low carb days. So basically, this is a more intense version of carb cycling. So basically, we're going to do our low carb day because we do one to two a week. We're gonna do that day, a version of it, for six days instead of one to two days. Yeah. And then and on the seventh day, we're going to have our cheat day just like normal. And that large amount of carbs will help us, again, keep our muscle. Yeah, and we're gonna train um, the same, same fasted cardio, same weight training. Well, um, depending on how we feel, we may lessen the amount of time we do fasted cardio like right now it's anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes that may need to drop just a little bit so that we can still get through our workouts but we will still be doing fasted cardio and we will still be training the same intensity and the same body parts everything like that and we always preach and we still agree with this you listen to your own body so yes and Again, this is not any specific fad diet. This is not a low carb or a keto specifically. This is our own version, again, to help us preserve our muscle but still lose a little bit of body fat. And because this is going to be fairly low carb, um, we are only going to do this for two to three weeks. Yeah. Um, this is a mini cut. This cannot go on for a long period of time because your body does lose its ability to utilize carbs properly if you do it for too long. Yeah, and you so. can't build muscle for too long um, on low carb. But yeah, like Nicole said, just try to lose some body fat and to hold on to our muscle. Exactly. So we can show off our hard work. Yeah. So um, you'll see what we're going to eat today and that we will eat that for six days and then um, we will reassess, see how it worked, see how we feel, see what our progress was like. And if we do change what we're eating, we will do another full day of eating for you guys and show you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, see you at our first meal. Okay, friends. My first meal is a cup of egg whites, but because we're doing low carb, I'm going to bump up the fats. I've got two full eggs in there. And the old standby, I put a little bit of no sugar added ketchup. I take this everywhere. You don't leave home without it. Okay, friends, this is my first meal. It is two stalks of celery with a tablespoon of this natural peanut butter. And two eggs scrambled with a tablespoon of just regular cheddar cheese and some salt and pepper. Mmm, delicious. Hi. Hi. It's time for the next meal. Yep. Here it is. Meal number two. For me is half a cup of oats with a, ta a, a tablespoon of sugar-free syrup on it. And I mixed the oats with this protein powder. This is the Mutant Iso Surge in Chocolate Fudge Brownie. And that's to up my protein. So this is the protein oatmeal. And that's all I put in it. 
And then this is Greek yogurt that I mixed with cocoa powder, which is just the baking cocoa. It has no sugar or anything in it. And the Great Value sweetener. And then there's half a cup of mixed berries on top. And they were the frozen ones and I just thawed them overnight so that they get their juice all juicy and flavorful in my <laughs> yogurt. Yep. Then mine is not as pretty as Nicole's, but it gets the job done. I've got half a cup of no fat Greek yogurt, a half a cup of mixed berries, um, a little a little squirt of the vanilla um, five to boost up. I need a little bit more fat, so I have five um, almonds chopped up in there as well. I'm also sticking to low carb, so I'm doing a half a cup of oatmeal. I've got a scoop of the Mutant Iso Surge chocolate in there, and yeah, I think that's about it. That's it, my friends. It's time to eat this. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, it's pre-workout time, my friends. We are having some BCAAs. This is three bottles of water, and the BCAAs that we have, it, it is called Pineapple Mango, and it is by Almax, and it's called Amino Core. These are, the Amino Core is some of our favorites. We are also going to have this pre-workout, and this is the BPI Sports Sour Watermelon, and it's the Vortex pre-workout, and this is one of our favorites too. And it tastes like Jolly Ranchers, watermelon Jolly Ranchers. And yeah. So we are having a full can of tuna each because we I'll need to up our can. protein. And it's this one here, the Clover Leaf Chunk Light Tuna. And we have a full tablespoon of this half the fat Hellman's Mayo in it. And we're having a cup of this bag salad. It's from Walmart, it's just gar normal garden salad and it has carrots, iceberg lettuce, and cabbage in it. And we're going to have a tablespoon of this zesty Italian, the calorie reduced from Great Value. Yep. Um, and just to be clear, we wanted to repeat that this day, this meal plan that we're showing you is specifically for dropping body fat and keeping your muscle. When you lose, are planning to lower your carbs and lose body fat, you generally, you may lose a little bit of weight too on the scale and you may lose a little bit of muscle, but our goal is to lose specifically the body fat while maintaining the, the bulk of our muscle. So yeah, hopefully that clears up any um, Question. questions. Yeah. Yeah. Let's eat. Okay friends, it's post-workout time. And I'm pouring my shake in my cup. Looks like you're spooning it more than pouring it. Oh, look at Mr. Funny Boy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I decided to make a thick one today, kind of like a milkshake, so I have to uh, spoon it because I used a lot of ice cubes. So I used about eight ice cubes and one cup of this creamy cashew milk, and it's the unsweetened vanilla flavor. And I use this, it's the Mutant Iso Surge Peanut Butter Chocolate Flavor. And I love it, and it has like little peanut butter pieces in it. Kyle's is the same except he has a cup of egg whites and just a little bit of milk. Same protein powder, and he put in some of this unsweetened baking cocoa and some of this sweetener. Yeah, I copied my wife except for a few ingredients. And he used a little less ice cubes. This is his is a little more drink drinkish and mine's a little more milkshake-ish. When you're that thick, you need a spoon. Yep. So yeah, I just bumped up the protein in mine. That's why I have the cup of egg whites in there. That's because he's got more muscles than me. I don't know. We're getting pretty beefy. <laughs> Dinner time. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Except it's dinner slash post-workout. Um, we have chicken breast. This is four ounces for Kyle and three ounces for me. And we both have one cup of stir-fry veggies. And it has a little bit of low-sodium soy sauce on it. And we also added salt and pepper to the whole meal. Yep. And that's it, my friends. 
We got one more one more meal left before bed. Yes. Yep. But that's it for dinner, silly boys. <laughs> <laughs> Last meal of the day, friends. Yes, sir. So we have some, I tried to make it look pretty and it just doesn't look pretty. So, <laughs> you know? The, uh, the glass is pretty, but there you go. there's nothing you can do with cottage cheese. To no, it. but this is half a cup of 1% cottage cheese. Um, a teaspoon of unsweetened baking powder, baking cocoa, sorry. Sweetener, half a teaspoon. And I have a tablespoon of this almond butter. This is the Our Finest from Walmart. And then Kyle has a tablespoon of the Kraft Smooth peanut butter in his. And that is our last meal. And it has fats and slow acting protein so that it keeps our bodies um, hopefully continuing to keep our muscle during the night. Yeah. So thank you for watching. Hope yeah. you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please feel free to put them below. And don't forget to check us out on Instagram. And if you don't like it, subscribe. You know about this, don't you? <laughs> and this one. You're going to have to eat two. One, two. Thank you. Bye, guys. You're weird. <laughs>